Hi, I'm Joe with Family Handyman. We all love having a clean, spotless car, and we love our pressure washers. Why not combine the two? Today, I'm gonna to show you how to pressure wash your car without damaging it. First thing you wanna consider, what type of pressure washer to use. This gasoline engine pressure washer, a little bit too powerful, 3,100 PSI. You wanna use an electric pressure washer between 1,200 and 1,900 PSI. Nozzle tips are color-coded to size. Choose a 25 degree green tip for cleaning wheels and caked on mud. A 40 degree white tip is ideal for all surfaces of your car. Park your car on a concrete or blacktop surface such as a driveway rather than a gravel surface. You could kick up a stone and scratch your paint or crack a window. Be sure all your windows are rolled up before starting. Pre-wash your car by starting at the top, spraying downward, removing any debris off the roof, hood, and trunk. Continue spraying downward on the side panels, wheels and hubcaps removing any stuck on mud. You can even clean the wheel wells. It's not recommended to spray directly into the front grill. You could damage the radiator. Instead, spray downward at a 45 degree angle. Most pressure washers have a soap tank you can fill. Be sure to follow the water to soap concentrate ratio. Fill the soap tank with a diluted soap solution. If your pressure washer doesn't have a soap tank, you will need to apply the soap by hand with a rag or a sponge. Set your pressure washer to the soap setting or swap out the nozzle to a soap nozzle. Again, starting at the top of your car, work your way down applying soap over the whole car. Let the soap sit on your car for at least five minutes. If you're washing your car in direct sunlight, you may want to wash one side at a time, rinsing the soap off before it dries. Time to rinse the car. Switch your pressure washer setting to water output or swap out the nozzle back to the 40 degree nozzle. Again, start at the roof of your car, working your way down to the hood, trunk, and sides, rinsing off the soap thoroughly. Repeat this two or three times until the vehicle is completely rinsed. Dry your car off with a hand towel, soft cloth, or chamois. This will eliminate any water spots by letting it air dry. There it is. Nice clean car and I didn't damage my paint. For more car detailing tips like this, visit us at FamilyHandyman.com.